Well, hello, 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 everyone. This is Cynthia Toep, Miss Flippy, your gypsy medicine woman. Let's see what the cards have to say today. I've been feeling a little blue today, and so, you know, yeah, I just had to get out and get my cup of coffee. Yeah, <laughs> we got to see. Ooh, we got it. We got the single woman here. Yeah, she's sitting there in her thorn, and she's crystal clear about her thoughts and her process, but she might be feeling alone. I don't know. Maybe that's why. <laughs> but, you know, something's going on. This is temperance. Bringing a balance. Bringing a balance within. <coughs> with the emotional self making sure you know that you, you you you've got this you can bring those lower emotions and those higher emotions together you know we it's in, it is about a balancing that the universe actually the universe has got its hands in the middle of this balancing to bring a a a, a more joyous more beautiful a harmony tone to it more musical tone to it <clears throat> divine's making a final decision <laughs> yeah it's making that final decision <clears throat> so you can feel grounded so you can feel whole so you can truly know your worth you know divine wants you to, to really know your worth you are very worthy you've been doing a lot of work excuse me at taking care of yourself you've been doing a lot of work at taking care of others you nurture you're kind you're sweet you're you're grounded you're whole you're complete <clears throat> You're solid, you're grounded, and you have your thoughts on there pretty crystal clear, you know. <laughs> and what's this all about? About that, about a soulmate connection. There is a soulmate connection that, you know, divine is in the middle of this mix about bringing this balancing going on. So you two can finally one day go to that beach and look each other eye to eye. Watch that sunset go down and spend that time together sharing each other's story, telling each other about, you know, how this journey has been how how it's been how your journey has been up until the point of time that you got connected this journey has definitely bringing you strength going through all the tornado moments so you can just walk through those tornadoes with courageous with the lion look at the lions look in your hand yeah and the lion's so proud of you about how strong you have been about going through your journey yeah, you're strong and courageous and, and confident in, in the person that you are. Yeah, nice. And then we got some, well, I don't know if that was a motorcycle or a race car going by for confirmation. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, it is, it is, you know, like the Divine Phenomenon. She's rewriting her story. She's probably looking at rewriting it again, you know, find, trying to find her passion, find that desire, what's going to light that fire, Ooh, what's going to light that fire, <laughs> we want that fire lit, you know, rewrite that story, re relay down the map, recolor it, you know, doing something new, some new beginning, as this divine masculine, he wants to make a new beginning too, he's just looking back at what he's leaving, He's going after his passion, he's going after his desire, but he's just taking a moment to look back to see, you know, what he's actually leaving behind. What is he leaving behind? Yeah, what's he leaving behind? We don't need to see what he's leaving behind. He wants to leave it behind. He don't want it here in the reading. <laughs> Let's see what the cards have to say next. <laughs> so we can just leave that behind, whatever it is. What's coming? What's coming in? What's in the present moment? What's coming towards us in the future? What is it that we need to know? <laughs> well, you know, we are in, still in the middle of laying down things to rest, laying down those stories that haven't served us. Then laying down those stories. Maybe making sure you're doing some sleeping and getting some dreaming done. You know, like some of the dreams that I've been having are about. <clears throat> actually meeting up with my counterpart and that we've been talking about those stories we've been talking about those stories about what the journey was for us to get together and for us to meet mm -hmm. it was a pretty cool dream mm -hmm. and we were we were looking each other eye to eye we were doing this kind of thing we were looking each other eye to eye, eye, to eye. but we weren't on the beach <laughs> we were at some uh, maybe a picnic table we were at definitely at a table you know, you know, maybe the Divine Feminine has a lot of extra worry going on. She's been rewriting the script, rewriting the story. She's so tired of having to rewrite that script, rewriting that story. She's got to get outside and take a look at the sun. Actually, she did get outside and there is no sun. The clouds are shining. The clouds are here. It's looking as, gro as gloomy as she is. So we're, <laughs> we're waiting for that sun to come out and shine. <laughs> yeah. I love reading the cards. I, I mean, no matter what I'm going through, the cards are always make me feel better, better. That divine masculine, he wants to come forward with crystal clarity. He wants those. He wants 
to to let his feminum know how he really feels you know he's he's just you know like he's read all the books he's he's got his map there he's done all the astrology stuff yeah he did all that <laughs> and he, he's like i'm ready i'm ready baby i want to come forward and let you know and so we have the highest priest going well the highest priest is trying to look into it trying to look into that story before he gets here let's see let's see what is it what is it you know divine knows things that you don't know let's see if that highest priest is going to show us anything <clears throat> about what maybe we don't know that it wants us to know yeah that divine masculine he's making plans i'm telling you he's making plans he's with action and passion and desire he's he's been planning this out for some time he's going now we're going to go do this and we're going to go do that we're going to go take care of our kingdom this way and we're going to do it together yeah <laughs> that's what the that's what the highest priest wants you to know that that divine masculine he he is in the background, whoever he is, wherever he is, he's back there making some plans for his divine feminine, who, whoever you are. <laughs> yeah, he's making his plans. He's starting to make his plans. He's making forward movement. This is three pages on the table. You know, this is, he's got his map out. He's making a forward movement. He has been really, really slow at making that movement because he wants to make sure he's going in the right direction. He wants to make sure he's making that right choice. He wants those brand new beginnings for his divine feminine, you know, a solid offer. He wants to be solid with her. He wants her to know that when he comes forward, that it's solid and that, <clears throat> that she knows that it's worthy. It makes her feel bright. It makes her feel shiny. It makes her feel worthy. It makes her feel well taken care of. Oh, she's even got a little house in the background. She's even got her own little house. Now that's something she's looking for. Yeah, that divine masculine, he has something that he wants to offer that divine feminine. And it's something to light her world up. It is about bringing the sun. <coughs> Say truth, truth. It's tr about bringing that sun into her life so she can actually feel happier, more vibrant, more loving, more kind. To so she can continue to share share her stories out to the world world to to nourish the world because you know she she. It's just full of things to nourish the rest of the world for is to keep believing in your stories keep believing in yourself keep going after your dreams don't let any emotional feelings stop you or get in the way <laughs> yeah 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 and then you know, those old emotional feelings you gotta go through a rebirth there's just a little bit left there to go you gotta go through that rebirth yeah <laughs> to allow that sunshine in the door <laughs> what else we got here today for the collective yeah we got some quick moving action this is going through that tornado movement no matter what it was that you're able to just like shift it up so it'll make it move around and so it's not actually you know staying in you or near you or part of your journey that's crystal clear mm -hmm. what we're doing is a bringing a brand new start a brand new fresh start where you're feeling vibrant you're feeling whole you're feeling complete you're feeling like that child like where'd all this energy come from oh yeah it's because i i didn't let that tornado come down and take my life away and that's crystal clear mm -hmm. We're starting over fresh, a fresh brand new start. Yeah, get that fresh brand new start going into the story, into the day. <coughs> cough, cough, and all that, this, all that choky, choky stuff means that that's confirmation. It is right. Here's a divine feminine to be with her, her divine masculine, making a power couple. This they are operating from passion and desire. This divine feminine, she's been conquering those dragons within becoming friends with those dragons allowing those dragons to to support her to lead her to guide her in this most beautiful way instead of taking her under you know because she, you know she went she went through that tornado she handled that tornado as it came out of mm -hmm. what else we got not divine masculine he's doing the same thing now you know these cards have been coming up kind of like together but they have been shuffling so, but they're coming out back to back quite a bit. That divine masculine's learning how to tame his dragons too within. <clears throat> right now he's leaving some of those dragons behind. <clears throat> That's just confirmation again. That divine masculine's leaving some dragons behind. Because he's learning to choose from his heart, you see. He's choosing from his heart and not from that mindset. The divine feminine, she's feeling more grounded, more whole, more complete now. 
and some because something magical is getting ready to happen she's got all the tools she knows exactly what to do but you know sometimes she does question herself she questions her journey something magical is going to happen what's magical that's going to happen those wishes and dreams those wishes and dreams that you got going on they may have been going on for years for a long time they're getting ready to come true <clears throat> So you keep giving love out there to above and it keeps coming down here to below to have that love be all in your life, all around you. Perfect. So beautiful. I think I'm going to end the reading there is because that's such a beautiful ending is let's end on our wishes and dreams. Let's allow those wishes and dreams to come true magically. <clears throat> this is Cynthia Toa, Man is Flippy. You're a gypsy medicine woman and your inspirational coach. Please come on live on to my Mondays and Thursday nights for your hidden love story where come on in join in with a chat a lot of people over there you know talking about their own hidden love story supporting each other as we're going through our own lower emotional stories and if you're there long enough you might possibly get a reading from me to you live on the channel <coughs> or at least be able to set one up okay have an awesome amazing beautiful day i love you guys butterflies till next time bye bye catch you